Bryant's dealer. Visit bryantdealer.com today. The moment you realize you have enough food for your guests, but not enough fridge. At Lowe's, we have more appliances to choose from, so you can get the right one at the right price right now. Get your choice of Samsung French door refrigerators for $9.99 at the Lowe's pre-Black Friday deals event. We are back. And we are about to talk to a man who talks to dolphins. What the? Next up. What the? What the? Shell made entirely of fried egg. The new Naked Egg Taco, only at Taco Bell. Happening right now for one night, more than a thousand people slept outside to try to raise awareness about homelessness in DuPage County. Yeah, and all morning, NBC 5's Lisa Chaparria has been live in Glen Ellen at one spot where people slept out last night. Hey, Lisa. Hey there, good morning, guys. Yes, their bags are now packed and they're heading to their nice warm homes and their nice warm beds. But uh, unfortunately, a lot of people in DuPage County don't have that same, uh, that same ability to do that. But now these folks, they have a better perspective on what it is like to be homeless. And they're all doing this for a good cause. Now, Bridge Communities had about 2,000 people all over DuPage County sleeping outside to raise awareness for family homelessness and to raise money to help them. Dozens of people slept outside of St. Petronil Church in Glen Ellen. Now, the money raised goes to Bridge Communities Transitional Housing Program. Organizers say $35 provides one night of housing and supportive services to a homeless family. Now, one girl, she decided to do this for her birthday. We've tried really hard to uh, raise our kids with, um, to be able to see the world through everyone's eyes. And um, so we were just really proud that when you know, she heard this opportunity. She said, I want to do this, and I also want to bring my friends along to know what this is like. Bridge Community said that so far they've been able to raise $70,000, and they're hoping to continue to raise more. Their goal in all of this is to help 10 families, 10 homeless families, have a home for a year. So a great cause out here this morning. Reporting live in Glen Ellen, Lisa Chavaria, NBC5 News. Lisa, thanks so much for that update. And thanks to those kids who were out there uh, brave and kind of a damp morning to make a difference. Yeah, it's a drizzle. It's foggy. It's putting me in a place right now. I was just telling you guys that <laughs> Not a I don't feel that good about it. But bring there's the sunshine from the inside. Trying, trying. You know, but there's also thunderstorms out there that we have to talk about this morning. For some of us, not everybody. But this is what it looks like uh, outside. Wow. You know, I, I don't like to use it all the time because it's just a wall of nothing. But what that is, is that's the camera from the Adler Planetarium looking toward the downtown skyline. And Lake Michigan's right here, and then the skyline's here. But again, you can't see any of that because of the fog. I did want to.